Welcome back ladies and gentlemen of the Wolf Den. Today I will be using my Die Assault Matrix Paintball Marker. No secondary on me today. I will be using my Red Dot. No magnifier in this specific game. But I'll also have my Green Laser and Foregrip made by Kill House Weapon System. My Gun Gear Pants. Top is all made by Die Paintball. My boots are made by Original SWAT. And my gloves and headpiece are made by... And my gillo and my camera's by Drift Camera, baby. Let's go. We're going to get it. We're going all the way to Oregon. It's going to be an amazing game. This is Super Game, ladies and gentlemen. Hoo ya. All right, here we are. Super Game. Let's tighten up the vest, make sure everything's locked. Legit. Securing my tank. Um, we are out here in Oregon, man. And it's a really amazing field. We're on an orchard. And uh, it's one of the most scenic fields I've ever seen. Pretty cool, man. And the Oregon players are very family knit, close, and uh, it says a lot about the community. You know what I'm saying? So, going out there using the box mag today. Feeling good, brother. Got some rest last night. Time to do what I do 110%. Prove the haters wrong, prove the ladies right. 147, who yeah? I don't know if it's friendly or not. I heard voices over here. No you get hit? No, I didn't get hit. Roger that. Moving. I like to lose dangerous. I like to trip on brains. <laughs> How did that happen? Long ball. Move, player! Hit player! You gotta move! Go, dude, go! Are you blue or red? Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. We need to get up this hill at Super Game. What's going on over there? It's crazy. So we got some guys, that, you know, it's a little bit of a ravine down here on the other side what of the road. Team are okay. you? What team are you? What team are you? They answer? No. no. You want me to ask? Watch, 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 watch. They're getting shot from over there. I'm going through the bush. Right. Excuse me. I think they're coming off the hill up there. Hey, what's your guys' status on Jaeger and such? Watch it, watch it, watch it. Move, 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 move. Hold, this hold on, on hold on. Hold on. Nope. What? Hold this while I talk to smoke? Yeah. No, 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 don't use it yet. Not yet? Alright. We, we have a coordinated effort. Move up, go down, go! Get him! Moving, moving. Gotta make sure there's no flammable bush. Gotta be safe as a smoke grenade, ladies and gentlemen. Protect the forest. Oh, I know. They're sp they sponsor me. <laughs> I see a lane. Gotta make sure that I can make it up, crawl through, and have decent cover. Yo, hitman. Yo. I'm moving up this. Where did Callie go? Did she go rogue? She got hit. Yeah, keep her inside the map. I'll try to cover you. I just can't see him down in the freaking. Yeah, I don't think I need it. I'll be okay for now. Remember my stalking rule. Avoid pathways. Make your own path because that's where they least expect you to come from. You see a wide open gap? Don't go. Roger that. The remainder of the video you will see me crawling. Crawling, crawling. Prone is awesome. On the front, on the right? Roger that. One of the tricks I try to teach people is when you're making a way through battleground area of operations go from tree to tree or cover to cover always see some cover ahead of you make your way to that instead of just walking in the open i'm your witness you're good
laid down some fire to put their heads down. Give us a chance to move up. Roger that. So in this specific episode, I will be showing you why we wear camouflage. Why we play stealthy. And how to stay hidden as you play. The topography here was awesome. But we were fighting an uphill battle. The hard thing about uphill battles is that those at the top of the hill have the advantage. Always easier to shoot down and up. Notice the trigger discipline, how my finger is not on the trigger until I'm actually ready to shoot. You do not want to shoot your own player in the back by accident. Yeah. Just shoot. Roger that. Notice how we're constantly communicating with each other, talking back and forth by keeping it quiet. Moving right! Now I stand up to get over these branches, but I find an amazing spot with this other player behind this tree. Come on! Nice kill, Wolf. Nice kill. Got one! Got one! We need more, more guys need to get up here now! You okay, bud? You okay? Watch that up there. Look between up there. How do that? Notice how I always try and make sure the other player is in good spirits after he gets hit and make sure he's okay. Okay, watch our six also. Woo! See what I mean? It's crazy that the player I was just warning to watch his back got hit from that position. He was a little exposed, but it's all good. He was really good to get there to begin with. Now this spot where I'm in is the perfect hide. It is a perfect spot to ambush players. I've got a massive tree right in front of me and two uh, big stalks of wood on either side of me. And it's like a V and I'm in the top of the V. And I'm going to constantly look left and right, keep scanning my area. Going to stay very quiet now. No more wolf yelling. <laughs> And uh, it's very cool because I can look from this spot and I can look from under the log beside me on my right. It's a great spot. Constantly scanning, listening to where the bad guys are. That is number one. If you're hunting in the woods, big, very important thing is to be quiet. Constantly giving away your position or your team position is what gets you shot out of the game. And I love guys like you who like to talk too loud when you don't need to. <laughs> Sometimes I do. I do a lot, but I do it on purpose when I already know that they know where I am or we are. It's an intimidation factor, but if I'm playing stealthy, I'm by myself right now, this is how you do it. Quiet and deadly, baby. Got another one. Notice when I shoot, I get right back down and hug the ground because uh, I just exposed my position. But I'm in such a good spot, I'm just laying down. I'm under this log right now. And they sent out a smoke grenade to try to conceal where they're coming from. But I'm not uh, shooting or talking unless I got it. This is where camouflage comes in beautifully. It's not just to look cool, but camouflage is very effective in the field. I have guys extremely close to me right now. 
And some of them are standing up between the smoke and the trees and the camouflage. They can't see me. Another one, baby. I had a gun cam on, but for some reason I totally can't find the footage. I'm kind of upset. If I do find it, I'll add it into another video or something. But notice how I shot. Went back down again under the log. Love it. Another thing to pay attention to is this why I play with my sleeves rolled down all the way. Uh, protection from the elements, uh, from the bugs, from the ticks, the fleas, the thorns. That's why I wear gloves and I wear all the way down my arms. I don't play with that t-shirt stuff because uh, I crawl through some nasty stuff, people. And I always get down and dirty, so you got to protect your body in many, many ways. It's getting dangerous now. I can hear them shooting all around me. I can hear bad guys talking all around me. The tricky part is, do I wait till they get close enough or get them at a distance? Because if I'm going to expose my position, i got to make sure I do it right. This is the most scary and most thrilling thing about paintball. <laughs> There's a guy on the other side of this tree, and I can hear him. I can hear him. I can't move under the log without exposing myself, nor can I go over it without exposing myself to him. So I have to try and hit him from the left side. Careful, careful. This kid's already hit, so I let him out, but I told him to be careful because he's going to get hit from other players. But I might have just given away my position doing that. Okay, okay, it's getting serious. I can hear his friends moving up. Watch this. I see movement. I see movement. I see a... Oh, there they are. There they are. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Got him. I think I got him. Oh, 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 oh. Oh. Nice. Get out of me. Listen. Yeah. <laughs> Listen, I had your crotch dead center, but I didn't want... Yeah, yeah. I had your crotch dead center, but I didn't want to hit you like that, brother. Good work, boys. Uh, I hope so. Yes, sir. Now look at this. Good shot, boys. Good shot. Look at all these. Coming out. Look at all these guys here coming down after I got killed. Huh? Thank you, brother. This is who I was holding back while I was there. Crazy. <laughs> oh my gosh. Is this what I was holding back? Yeah. <laughs> I'm glad I got hit up. Damn. That would have been painful. That's how effective one good player can be to hold back half an army. Coming out! I'm coming out! Thank you for watching. Share this on your social media. Hit that like button. Subscribe. See you tomorrow.